Hi, this is Brian. Today we're going to talk about wood drying. The wood species is an important factor. Each species will dry a little differently. One main reason is the wood's density. Another name for the density is called specific gravity. The denser the wood is, the larger the specific gravity number will be. In general, a wood species with a high specific gravity will dry slower. The moisture content of wood is made up of two types of water. The free water will leave and enter the wood fairly easily and at low temperature. Once the free water has been removed, only bound water remains. This bound water is found within the cellular structure of the wood. It's harder to remove, takes longer, and requires a bit more energy. Percentage-wise, there is much more free water in wood than bound water. In general, wood that is below 25% moisture content is all bound water. Removing just some of the bound water can take as much as 30% of your overall drying time. As the wood dries, it will start shrinking, but it only shrinks during this phase of removing the bound water. Uneven shrinkage is the reason for wood degrade. There are some factors of shrinkage that have nothing to do with the quality of drying, but for now, we're only going to talk about the things we can control. If we dry too fast, the surface, or shell, could start shrinking well before the rest of the wood, resulting in surface cracks, also known as checking. With proper drying, this defect can be avoided. Over drying the surface is also called case hardening. This is important to know because case hardening traps in the water we're trying to remove. Water does not want to move through a dry surface. It's the same reason a dry sponge does not absorb water. Okay, so how do we fix or even prevent this? Conditioning is a method of adding water to the shell and keeping it from over drying. If the surface is properly hydrated, then water will want to move and leave the wood. Wood drying in a vacuum environment also promotes water movement. Water wants to move from a high pressure to a low pressure. If you were to remember just two things, one, keep the surface hydrated, two, dry slower in the beginning, keep your temperature low until you're below 25% moisture. Be sure to check out our forum and start a conversation. And if you haven't already done so, check out our many other videos on our YouTube channel.